Good afternoon. Welcome to my world. I hope you have a good day. First thing we're going to do is look at creating a real life character using the body and the head. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to say I want to create a character. I'm going to create the bot of Buffalo. This says the resolution is too large and they need to optimize it. So I'm just going to say yes. And so here's our character. I don't want to add any pins or anything to it. So we're just going to say okay. Now we're going to say we want to create a head. I want to create a morph based head. And so here's our head. We're going to say open. Now it's going to give us the window that allows us to create the talking part of the head. So we're going to say next. Now we have to line up our little dots. Now it wants us to do the face fitting. I like the double. This is the eyebrows. Now when you do the eyebrows, this is the part that allows you to get your raised eyes, which you need to have in your expressions. The part that I'm doing up here is going around the outside, so we'll still be able to get the... We want to make sure that when he tilts his head, we, we got the horns and everything in place. The main part will go around his face. And then the outer part will cover the ears and the horns. I need to go in so I can see it better. When you get the red look like that, that's where you can move the entire thing instead of just one piece. It's very important when you're doing the eyes and the lining up the character, it's very important that you take your time with this because once you have it set, uh, that's how the, it's going to look when you actually begin to use it and talk and move the eyes. And uh, to get that realistic look, you have to really get it right on or you end up with that little fake look. Um, and some of these that I'm doing, they're not an easy animal. I mean, it's an animal. It's not a easy, you know, three-step thing. You have to really play with it to get it lined up to where it won't look fake. And you use the little hand to move it up a little. And then you have to go back to the arrow to be able to move it again. And we've got this... Our nose and everything is way too high. This is your mouth. Your nose. And now the mouth, we have both parts of the mouth. We have the, the top and we want both parts. So we're going to click this, which will give you both parts of the mouth, the upper part of the mouth. So you can take and line up the upper part right along the lips, right where they go. And that's really frustrating when it does that. I'll go ahead and separate them a little until I get the top lip lined up. And then I move the bottom lip. Since his lips are closed, you move the bottom lip right up at the nearly the same place. Okay, now we're going to see. Smile. Angry. Sad. Happy. Surprised. And scared. Okay, so now we got it. Okay, see this part here is out a little too far because that doesn't fit good in his lips. So we've missed his lips there. A. E. There we go. I. O. U. And. Meow. Okay, so we need to come out a little more on the outside. We're missing part of the piece. Eyes closing and blinking. Up, down, left, right, and rolling. A, E, I, O, U, and Meow. Smile. Angry. Sad. Happy. Surprised. 
surprised and scared. Now it gives you a deal so that you can set the face mode up. Okay, now we need to take and line him up with his real head. That's about right. And let's see if we can make him talk. Let's just bring in a... Um, I've already made a little wave file. Good afternoon. Welcome to my world. I hope you have a good day. So we have our voice hooked up. Now we just need to make him move. Make his face do a little movement. We want to do his eyebrows and his eyes. We don't need the face. And we're going to preview to see how we need to, what we need not to do. It doesn't look good when we move him sideways. We can move him up and down. Okay, so now we're going to start recording, which, and when we record, the voice will start. Good afternoon. Welcome to my world. I hope you have a good day. And so that's, let's see what we got. Good afternoon. Welcome to my world. I hope you have a good day. So there's our first little animation. And what we'd like to do is select all. And we're going to put it in. Let's see if we can put it in the custom character. We want to add it to custom character. And this is going to be the talking buffalo. We've got it saved. We can work with it. And let's go on to our next project.